Hey everybody, welcome into Simul Gaming. You join us here on Bassmaster. I'm just doing a little bit of a fishing series at the minute just to get some more fishing videos out on the channel. So yeah, this is Bassmaster as I've uh, just mentioned and we're on, I think it's Chickamau Chickamauga, I think, is that how you pronounce it? Uh, Lake uh, and we're just about to do just a session on there, just a free session, it's not a tournament or anything like that. Um, yeah, just to get back into this. It's the first time I'm playing this in 4K, actually, so... Let's get out. Looking forward to this. Go and find a spot. We would just try in here. We're going to cast a little bit into the uh, into the sun. Let's have a look. So this is what I've got: sledgehammer, swim, jig, silver flake, shad. Got bl uh, braid black, forty pounder, and we've got a Carolina rig. We see we're there with the weight on it, and that'll get it down fairly quickly. Whiteboard spinning reel, whiteboard. Um, in fact, we could. I don't know if we could change. Uh, no, I don't want to delete it. Um, yeah, we could be doing with changing that at some point. I'll change that after this uh, session, actually. So, what I'm going to do is just do a couple of casts out here. Let's see how we get on. Hopefully, we're going to get into some bass. That's cast out pretty quick. Nine foot of water. Oh, straight away. Crikey. Instant. That was good. Don't know if it's a bass or not. Good sized fish though. Wow, that was pretty instant, wasn't it? Get a bit of tension on. Oh, I think it is a bass, yeah. Awesome. Right away, folks. I love these sort of more shallower waters. Let's try and get this fish in if we can. He's in. Good bass to start. What a fish. That's awesome. Check out the green beast from beneath. A green beast from beneath, indeed. Right, let's just cast a little bit into here again. That was pretty good, that. I don't know if I pronounced that right. Chicka, chickam, Chickamooga or something it's called? Chickamonga? I don't know if I pronounced it right. Mooga? M A U G. Whoa. What have we got here? Interesting fish. Right, got the little stupid landing meter thing. Got it that time. It's another bass. Cool. Spotted bass. It's one pound five ounce. I'm gonna stick with this spot actually because it's quite productive. 93%. Let's get this out. So, yeah, attention set to 22. Retrieve set to 3. So, we are retrieving it back fairly quickly. See fish in the swim. Just do a stop and go. Constant, there we go. Stop and go. Some big fish going through the swim. Whoa, that was last minute. That was really last minute. Is it another bass? It's a good little spot, this. Bit more tension on it. Oh, it's a big un. It's a big un. He's a clonker. So we've got some a feral poundage line on. Let's try and get this fish in. I do need to change my reel, really. I like these spool reels. Right, is he coming in? He's coming in. He's a good fish. Oh, missed him. Got him that time. I don't like that landing thing. Oh, look at the size of that bad boy. Let's get a picture. Goodness me, toggle view. Right, let's get a picture because that could be the cover. Decent fish. I think we've found a really good spot here. Oh, 
God, that was instant. Right away. Blimey. What happened then, folks? That was instant. Wowza. Black crappy, three pound nine ounce. Yeah, I'm just loving this sort of evening sunset. Let's just cast a little bit into that hollow again. It's like that sink night. It's only nine foot of water. Very productive. You can see the sort of shadows cast over the water there, so I'm really sort of casting. Oh, I'm right away again. Perfect strike. Oh, wow, this is amazing. This is so cool. That tension up a little bit, hopefully it's a bass. Can't see it at the minute. Are we on? Are we on? No, not yet. Oh well, it could be a bass. Oh, I don't think it is. He's in. Oh no. It's a walleye. Six pounder. I can't believe the amount of fish that are in this spot. Let's just cast a little bit over to the left a little bit. So yeah, I've got the retrieve set to three. Which I think is probably about right. was last minute again. I was just about to pull that up then. Goodness me. Yeah. In you come. Yes. Right away. That's not a bad fish. Smallmouth bass, three pound four rounds. Excellent. That's what we want. Let's just try a cast over my shoulder into this hole here. Cause this looks super fishy. This looks a good spot on here. Between those two boulders would be quite good. Let's just try in between there. Oh, that was a good cast. How deep is that? 9.9 .9 feet. Okay. Awesome. Plenty of fish going through the swim. Stop this lure. That's it. Let's keep it moving. Oh, nothing on that cast. Stick with it though. Because you never know. Some good fish going through the swim. There's a big fish. See it on the fish finder? Two big fish. Just do a couple more casts in there. That was a good cast. Yeah, I've got so many lures now to choose from, but I kind of really like this lure, actually. I feel like it gets down to the bottom fairly quick. It's got that little weight on it, of course. It just gets down to the depths fast. Let's try back over here again, see how productive this is again. 
See what I mean? Right away. Instant. Oh, I lost it. Too late. I just saw the, I just saw the rod moving, or the lure moving then. It's crazy, isn't it? As soon as it touches the water. Hopefully we'll get into the fish again. Not in that cast. Let's move over a little bit to the left. There's many a time in deeper water where I just use this lure and I just let it sink and sink and sink on the way down, the fish take it on the way down. Don't even need to reel in, it just takes it. Amazing. Casting into the shadows. Ten foot of water. Stick with it though. Whoa, God, I was about to take that out then. Oh my God, it was a pure strike too. We landed it. Little white crappy. Little white crappy. Okay, let's fire it into the corner. Again, 94%. A big fish going through the swim now. It's amazing the amount of fish just take it at the last minute, even. I do like some of these surface lures that you get too, actually, they're pretty cool. A little bit stop and go. Let's try one more cast into this hot spot. Ooh, 98%. It's a long cast. There we go. We're in perfect straight. It's a bit of a hot spot that there, you know. I think we've got another what have we got here? Can't tell. Ooh, it's a little walleye. That is a proper hot spot there, isn't it? Oh god, right away again. Look at that, as soon as that lure hit the water, bang, gone. Instant. It's a little crappy fish. Literally. Oh no, it's a bluegill. Yeah, it's a bluegill. Oh, 99. Longest cast yet. Just keep an eye on it, you never know at the last minute. No, nothing doing. Okay. Let's just move it back around again. I'm just sort of aiming for that tree right in front of me. There you go. And again. That is definite hot spot. Is that a bluegill? He's in anyway. It's a bluegill. Trophy. Trophy fish. Two pounds, two ounce. So see that tree right in front of me? That is what I'm aiming for, basically. And there you go, and again, perfect strike. A 
black crappy. I don't mind catching a small fish. Let's see if it does it again. That's bizarre. Anything? Anything? No, not that time. Yep. Oh, a perfect strike. God, we are well catching. Not always bass though, but we are catching. Oh yeah. White crappy. That's a big in that one, isn't it? A trophy. Two two pound four ounce. Crack, it's getting bigger and bigger. I'm enjoying this too much now. Just wind on a little bit. It just isn't deep in there at all. It's fairly shallow. Oh, last minute. Amazing. Good strike. I think it's a walleye this one. Again, we're sort of lacking a little bit on the bass front. But we are catching. It's a good little session. It's a good session. Let's just turn the actual... Spool up a little bit. There we go. He's in. He's in. Good job. Nice walleye. Seven pound at four rounds. Sharp teeth. Stick with it. Stick with it. There you go. Right away again. Good strike. Awesome. That is the spot. That's the spot. 100%. Every cast we're catching something. Oh, it's a long, it's a longer, I think. Is it longer? Different fish again. Interesting. Weird looking fish, isn't it? What a finned freak of nature. Long nose gar, that's what it is. It's a gar fish. Deadly predator, of course. There we go, amber away again, folks. This is how we do it. Catching everything but bass. Highly productive uh, session, this one. Catching just about every single species, casting in the same place. Same thing's happening every cast oh missed it missed it oh man what is he doing he's in anyway oh it's a bass tiny little bass spotty oh bass oh boy you're gonna have to do some measuring yeah not very big is it I hate that dialogue can we turn that off I think we can, can't we? There is a way of turning it off. Let me just use my mouse. Uh, video and audio. There we go. I saw it somewhere. Dialogue. There you go. Let's get that turned down. Let's rubbish that in it. Let's apply that. Space. Awesome. I hate that dialogue. This kind of cheapens the game a bit. Love the fact now I can play these games in 4K. Makes such a difference to the overall experience of playing the game. Whoa, that was a good one. That was a good take last minute again. I think it's a bass, you know. Oh, missed it. Got him. He's in. Whoa, what a clunker. What a fish. Three pound one ounce. That's a good one. We're definitely coming back to this spot again. 
Do you reckon we're going to catch again? I do. <laughs> oh my god. Brilliant session. Little white crappy. I'm sorry we're not moving around, folks, but it's just quite productive, this one. In this spot, with this lure. And again, good strike. Oh, this could be a good fish. Is that a blue gill? Nice looking fish. I do like the blue gill. Look well cool, don't they? Let's do a few more casts, I think. And again. Oh, he's come off. He's come off. It's just. Wow, but caught again, though. <laughs> On the retrieve. Awesome. On the retrieve. Another little bluegill. I don't want to say it. If I cast now, is this, is this going to land right on a fish's head again? We've not found the glitch in the game, have we? Inadvertently. No, not that time. Oh, I'm loving this at the minute. It's so cool. I thought it'd be good to go back to our fishing routes, actually, and get, get some uh, uploads, fishing uploads, Bassmaster and the catch. You know, after all, it is a sport, and it is uh, the backbone of this channel, really, originally. Um, it's what the channel was built on. Still get so many of my fishing videos that get watched. Here we go, we're in. Oh, now this looks a good one. What have we got here? Is it a bluegill again? It's a big, big fish. Is it a personal best, maybe? That's awesome. Look at that fish. Trophy fish. <whistles> digging it. We're digging it. I know it's getting boring, this, but let me just try a couple more casts. We can move the boat around. I'll move it around and see. Oh, God, right away again. Is that a bass? Mm, can't tell. No. Black crappy. Pretty awesome, isn't it? Pretty awesome. Just cast into the darkness a little bit. That tree. You can see it's getting pretty dark. Yes. Another good fish. Let's keep that rod up high. Watch the tension. I think it's a good sized bass, this one, folks. I thought I got that then. And he's in. Oh, some fish. Four pound five ounce trophy white bass. There's a view. What a fantastic looking fish. That'll be my cover. Right. I've always found it a winner this lure. I'll just remind you what it is again in a second. Got another blue gill. 
£1.13 ounce. So just to remind you what it is, it's the Sledgehammer Swim Jig Silver Flake Shad Nichols Lures, that's what it is, it's a 4 inch lure, uh, I'm using Braid Black which is £40 line, probably a little bit excessive to be honest, but that's what I'm using. Carolina Rig, you can see there, uh, it's a 7 gram uh, rig, you can see that it's got the weight on it, see after the red... I don't know what you call that, red beads, you've got the, the weight, um, so that gets it down quick. I'm using the white bird spinning reel, although I might change that reel for a little bit more of a, 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 a you know, one, not a fixed spool uh, reel, one of the other ones, I don't know what you call them, but um, yeah, I might change, I might change it to one of them. Uh, Favourite uh, white bird spinning 7 foot 2 inch um, rod that I've got that I'm using there too. Um, so on the other um, rig that I've got set up here I've got the Rattle Trap Chrome Blue Black Lure which I really like I've got a Super FC Sniper uh, line which is £7 it doesn't have a weight on it and I've got the same reel and rod so that's kind of what I'm using here let's just shift the boat around I really enjoyed that that was a really good little session look at that moon Could go fishing off them rocks. Looks pretty good. These rocks can be quite good. Let's have a little bit of a a couple of casts in here and see what we can. Probably a little bit too close to the rocks actually, but let's just cast ahead of ourselves. See if we get into anything. It, oh, 10 feet of water. Okay. It's got down to the bottom, you see, pretty quick that lure. There's a few fish in the swim, so let's just do a couple of casts, see if we get into anything here. I love casting into shallows, I love casting up against rocks and reeds. That's kind of like my kind of chosen tactic, if you like. Let's just bring that down to 23. I'll just give it a few casts, let's see, here we go. Sometimes it can take about 5-10 minutes. That's a good cast. Definitely fish going through the swim, you can see them on the fish finder. What if we do a cast out towards the houses? Let's just do that. Just as a bit of a comparison, how deep is that water? That is 10 foot 7. So again, the lure's pretty much slammed to the floor of the lake. Let's just try out the back here. There we go, that's it. You've got to find the fish. That's the idea. I think it's a bluegill again. Is it a bluegill? A walleye? Oh, missed it. Missed it? What's going on? Got it that time. It's a bass. We got a bass. That's a cool coloured bass, isn't it? Spotted bass, 2.2 .2 ounce. 2.2 pound .2 ounce. Let's just cast up against these rocks a little bit. 
that's quite a good strong cast. It's like that sink. A few fish jumping around us. It's always oh that was last minute. Literally last minute. Oh my giddy Anna, I was about to take that out there. That's awesome. Play it again. Got him. He's in. Oh, good fish. My god, I didn't realise it was that big. That took that just as I was just pulling the lure out. Cracking fish. So again, quite productive. You know, you just choose your sports. Like I say, I do like fishing up against rocks, rocky outcrops. I've got the retrieve on this one set to three. I've got a blue bluegill again. Good little session this, good session. If you guys like your fishing, let me know in the comments. I know it's a bit of a niche one this one, but you know, it's quite enjoyable really. It's quite it's just chilled out, isn't it? You're not racing about doing something against other other people as such, you're just like chilling out, a bit of fishing. Of an evening. Do as many fishing sessions as you want. Of course I jump between the catch and Bassmaster. Again, last minute again, look at that, blimey, that was quite Oh, just not in the zone yet. He's in now. He's in. Catching a little bit more bass this time. Useful to know if you're in a tournament. This spot seems to be quite productive. 94%. What was that? There we go, she's in. See how quickly that sinks to the bottom. So about seven. Point two foot of water. Ninety six percent that time. loads of fish around you can see them whoa good strike not a perfect strike but it's good enough is that another bass do you think bit of strain oh no it's a uh, long nose gar this is a massive fish this is a big one this is weird prehistoric looking fish let's bring it in it's coming in now I think it's a big long fish, that's Christ. He's in. Fourteen pound one ounce. Forty seven inches long. Blimey Riley. Alright. Ninety six percent. Look at that, we're getting better at casting. Just let that sink. Start reeling back. Love the reflections on the back of his neck here. You see that there, the water reflections. Here we go, we're in a decent fish again. It's a nice bass again. Good job. Oh, he's not ready yet. I've got it first time. Awesome fish. Right, let's get a screenshot of that. We'll use that as a amazing cover shot. Look at that, what a fish. Let's do a few more casts. Again, I found a bit of a hot spot here, so we keep playing that hot spot. Just don't change your lure. Just use the same tactic. Let's bring the uh, 
reel down a little bit to 23. It's nice and easy. So I'm just trying to build up some points so I can get myself some different attire. Oh, I think we're into another bass. Yeah, just trying to get more equipment and stuff. Oh, missed it. Got him. Brilliant. Awesome. So yeah, drop me a note in the comments. Is, is Bassmaster something you want to see more of? Do you play Bassmaster? Do you enjoy it? What's your favourite lake? What's your biggest fish? What's your best equipment even to use? I could be doing with some tips uh, on this. Uh, do enjoy it. So that's quite a few of the bugs ironed out of it now. Good to get some fishing back out on the channel. And it's even better to be able to play it in 4K and record it for you guys to view. So that makes me very happy indeed. Just try a couple more casts. But yeah, I appreciate it if you guys enjoy the video. If you drop me a sub, that would be brilliant. You can, you can see we've got all sorts of uh, various sports simulation games on the channel. If you do like your sports simulation, it's definitely worth a look. Try and get a couple of uploads done a day and a few shorts out and stuff like that. So yeah, it keeps me busy. There we go, perfect strike. He's in. Nice little uh, black crappy. Yeah, again we've hit a bit of a hot spot here. Yes! Love it when the heartbeat goes. Here we go, we're into another bass, folks. Great little session, this. Good mixed bag. Quite a few bass, though. Been really productive. And he's in. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Drop me a sub, I'd really appreciate it, like I say. Um, and a like on the video. And uh, spread the love. Join the community at Simwall Game, and I'll catch you guys on the next fishing upload.